Hey guys, I'm Sebastian. I'm Christine. This is Ninth Island Connection, your weekly lifestyle resource for all things Vegas. Check out the description below so that you can see how you can watch our television show wherever you are. And if this is your first time here, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Go ahead and subscribe to our channel. All we do is bring you Vegas, hotel reviews, room tours, restaurants, off strip, like really just everything Vegas. And that's why you're here, right? So why wouldn't you subscribe? All right, in this video, we are getting ready to head to the pool, and that just happens to be what our, this whole video is about. You saw the thumb. This is our five favorite pools here in Las Vegas, including both the Strip and downtown. So let's get to it. First up, we're gonna get started with Bellagio. First of all, it's absolutely beautiful. I mean, look at this right here. It's a super chill property. It's spacious. You don't feel like it's crowded. And you know what? The location on the strip is absolutely perfect. What I love is that it's just such a chill, beautiful pool. You just really feel like you're relaxing and on vacation. Next up is the pool, or rather the pools, at Caesars Palace because there are seven of them. And we just love this place because it's so spacious so you never really feel super crowded in a pool. And I also just love all of the details at Caesars Palace that have just continued into the pool. It's just beautiful. Now, I've never done this before, but I love the fact that they have blackjack in a pool. They call it a swim up, but I've never seen anybody swim up to it. You can just walk, you can just walk 
there. Um, I've never done it before again, but I love that there is an option if you want to play blackjack in a pool in Vegas because it's Vegas and why wouldn't you? You can do that at Caesars Palace. And you know what? It's a beautiful spot. Next up, we're heading over across the street to Flamingo. Now this is a very popular pool in Vegas and I just love how tropical it feels. It's kind of like the flamingo habitat continued into a party pool. One of the great things about the pools at Flamingo is that the party area is 21 and over. So you have to have your ID ready. They are very strict about this upon entering. There's a DJ, there's a little cove just like this right here. It's such a cool little spot. They also have a family pool that's, well, like I said, it's a family pool, so it's family friendly and it's completely separate from the party pool. But from certain spots, you can still hear the music and all the action going on down there, but it's a lot more chill and reserved than the party pool. Next on the list is Mandalay Bay. Now, you can't even call this a pool. Like this is like a pool complex. It's amazing. There's an actual sand beach. There's a wave pool. There's a lazy river. There's multiple chill pools. There's party pools. There's hot tubs. It's just awesome. This is just a tropical oasis in the desert. We cannot end this video without talking about downtown. We're heading to the tank. This is over at Golden Nugget. And you know what? If you've seen them on social media, you know that they have sharks in a massive fish tank that in the center of the pool with a slide that goes through the center of this fish tank that's in the center of the pool. I mean, how much more Vegas can you get than this property right here? This is always a fun time. They've got cabanas, they've got an adults only pool upstairs. And you know what? It's just always a fun time. If you're staying downtown, definitely check out the Golden Nugget Look at this. I mean, seriously, where else can you have a water slide through a shark tank? That's crazy and only in Vegas.
right guys, there you have it. That's our five favorite pools here in Vegas. But you know what, really, there's not a bad pool in Vegas. A, a Vegas pool experience is just fun, mm -hmm. but some pools are better than others. I think they just have different offerings. Mm -hmm. Depending on what you're looking for, that's one of the things that I love about this city. There's literally something for everyone. And if you're looking for more information on the pools, check out the description. We'll have our playlist for all the pool tours that we've done, all their pros and cons for pools, and just kind of what you can expect if you're going to the pools here in Vegas. That's a wrap on this one, guys. Again, like Christine mentioned, we wanna hear from you guys. Comment below, what is your favorite pool to chill, to party, to nap, to read a book? Whatever it is that you come to Vegas and you're like, I had the best time at the pool. What was that? Where was it? Share below with everybody else here. And please give us a like, subscribe to our channel, and reach out to us on social media. We're Ninth Island Connection everywhere. We also go live every Wednesday where we bring you an update on what to expect that upcoming weekend. So we go live on Wednesday. We let you know what's going on in town on Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday if it's a long weekend. And we're talking construction, weather, events, grand openings, what's shutting down, if the volcano is still going outside of Mirage, everything going on in town so that you can have the best possible experience while you're here in Vegas. All right, thanks guys. Four hours a day, seven days a week in a city that never sleeps, Ninth Island Connection will take you there. You won't want to miss a beat as we give you a sneak peek inside the biggest, best, and most outrageous hotspots both on and off the strip. Be sure to tune in to Ninth Island Connection with Sebastian Rodriguez every week. Great people, great stories, great connections, only on Ninth Island Connection.